Hey, it's again me, that, and today I will show you another PSP special. Um, the last PSP special was um, about the 4.01 testing tool firmware, which is in fact a debug firmware of the PSP. Um, let's see, this is a white PSP 1000 with the most recent custom firmware, the 6.60 ME 1.8 by the developer Neuron. Um, sounds, it maybe sounds a bit um, boring, but I have another testing tool firmware today. It's not as outdated as the 4.01, but just, just see yourself. It's even newer than the, in the internet available 6.00 testing tool, which was the most recent available testing tool firmware, which I was able to install. Um, by the way, I'm using the Pandora installer for this testing tool firmware because the other way to install testing tool firmware is the XGAN updater from the 5.50 GAN D3 custom firmware. It just supports um, the 6.00 testing tool and older testing tool firmware, so this one is not supported, so that's why I need another way to install it. This way is, by the way, faster. You can see it in it's installing several files. You can see the path, the name, and other stuff, but that's not important. Nearly every testing tool firmware has the same files. From from the name, of course, of the files updated. So the installation is nearly done, and let's reboot into the new testing tool firmware. Installation was a success, that's nice. Now let's see, English, pretty hard to see. My PSP 1000 is from Asia, so I have to press circle instead of X to confirm. But that's no problem, we can change it in the debug settings. Um, at first, the star indicates that it's a development feature, quick sign up, title stop preview and well, in-game for the store. That are debug features you see in the network um, column, there are some things missing like well, the user manual, Skype, also here is missing the information board. You can't watch videos, you can't listen to music. It might be possible to um, to watch UMD um, videos and listen to UMD music. I haven't tested it yet. Um, the game category looks normal. It has game sharing, safe data and the memory stick. It's possible to view photos mostly because, well, for finding exploits in the, in the photos, like the famous TIFF exploits, so I think Sony added this, the debug firmwares, so if anyone finds it, they can close it. Um, the network update is missing, that's normal at debug firmwares. Quick change of the color, let's see what the best, let's take red. First, we have color space, which is act actually just an option in the bug units in the PSP 3000, E1000, and PSP Go. If I change it to normal, the screen won't change. It's act actually available that the depth of the color changes, but well. And yeah, there we go. Version 6.60 testing tool revision A. Most recent firmware as custom firmware, original firmware, and testing tool firmware.
then there is install packages which was added somewhere between 6.00 and 6.60 I would guess 6.3 since I heard rumors that the 6.20 does not feature this but who knows and the well-known debug settings at first I will change the button behavior so the circle button is like um, American and European PSPs that the X button is for confirmation and the circle button is for going back for cancelling stuff and UMD cache for also known from well PSP 2000 and Euro available memory that's um, because the debug units um, are running software like a PSP 1000 they use the O1G as um, well as a shortcut like the PSP 2000 has 02G but the debug units have the full 64 megabyte of RAM so changing this at a retail PSP what mine is it does not change anything it does not get magically more RAM um, USB GPS driver you can use the release version since the 6.60 testing tool was released before the actual 6.60 version I think the release driver is from the 6.50 or 6.39 and the debug is well a version which was available before the official 6.60 so it might be nearly the same then you can enable flash player we know this feature from the recovery menu of several custom firmwares GPI memory stick lock emulation this might be um, for simulating uh, write locks there are some memory sticks with a little pin if you move it you can't write anything on the memory stick DVD mode speed is also um, well it does nothing at a retail PSP but at the debug um, unit this is for um, like emulating if the UMD is lagging or if you well if your wireless LAN is not that good memory block overflow check is well yeah what it says you can check if there's um, a buffer overflow in the memory this is a new feature which was, which was not in the 6.00 you can um, run the wireless LAN at full speed which wasn't available um, in the prior firmwares I think it was possible at the 5 point whatever custom firmwares like M33 and GAN but it was removed since the 5.70 for the Go or the 6.00 for other PSPs that the um, wireless LAN just runs on the 222 megahertz so um, it was cause a lot of PSPs died because they were too hot because of the wireless um, yeah USB serial another feature NP environment NP debug like emulating debug em environment is I think for the PSN service ID is another thing about the PSN and NP um, DRM debug is well the DRM production but for well like debug units and the install packages is known from the um, PS Vita, from the PS3, and like you can see, also available at the PSP. It was before I found this um, testing tool updater. It was not really known if the PSP features an install package function. It was rumored, but not really known. But if you press X it says install failed because I have no packages on my PSP and I'm not sure where to place them mostly in the root like with the P3 but you can't be sure um, yeah the network update is missing which is sad there might be a way to get um, newer testing tool farmers even if the 6.60 should be the latest um, yeah music and video is not available photo there was nothing special and interesting is that safe data you have a little check function you can um this says okay let's search one which is not okay there should 
B1, which is not okay, like from a homebrew, which saved something. I have so much stuff on this memory stick. I think I also have some edited. There, we have no picture. Check. There, it says error, no icon zero. And the wave change to something weird. It looks like the colors of Dortmund. Um, I'm not sure why it changed colors. But it's interesting. Um, we have the same feature at the memory stick. This is by the way my, well, flasher memory stick. It has a lot of the pro updaters, a lot of the LME and me updaters. It also has the hands and the um, light custom farmers, even downgraders. And there's a new thing is um, somewhere between the 6.00 and 6.60 testing tool farmer, they um, added the path. You now can see the path of the files, which was not available in earlier testing tool farmers. You see, I have a lot of stuff on the stick. This one is um, the passport from the Japanese PSN, so you can port, well, kind of import your UMDs to your PlayStation Network account, but only if your UMD is Japanese and your PSN is Japanese. They do not release this for um, America and Europe, which is pretty sad, but it can run. Um, this GAN updater is in the um, in the um, update folder, like if you want to install an update. So that's the reason why you can't use the check function. It's disabled for, um, for the updater path. Um, that's for an example the um, PSP finder. Param SFO is not like it should be and the icon is not like it should be. So these are some interesting features. I have not tried to um nope. I have not tried to install um Pro LME or the 660 hand with this testing tool farmer. I will do that later and check if it's possible. And yeah the PSN settings it's possible to sign in, it's possible to view the PlayStation Network but um opening the PlayStation Network will give you a blank page or an error and don't know why could be that Sony released a 6.60 testing tool revision B, but yeah. Well, this was in general my video about the 6.60 testing tool farmer, which is most recent available. And yeah, I'm that, and see you soon.